Hi, welcome back to Moose and Chemistry. We're looking at naming acid compounds, lesson number one. All right, so naming acids is a little bit different from, say, naming um, molecular covalent compounds or even ionic compounds. All right, so let's go ahead and let's get started. Let's look at our first acid here. How do we know it has an acid? Well, acids usually have H right here, H right in front of them, right? So that's a good indicator that that's an acid. Okay, so now let's go ahead and look at this. So we're going to start right here, X right here, and the first element or polyatomic ion. So we're looking at this element right here. Okay, is it a metal or non-metal? It's a non-metal. Is the first element hydrogen? And you would say yes, it is. So you put a check mark right there. Does the anion, that's this thing right here, does the anion contain an oxygen? Why yes, it does. So put a check mark right there. All right, is the anion ending in ITE or ATE? All right, well now it's a sulfate, right? So it ends in ATE. So it says change the anion ending to IC and put acid after name. So this would be hydro, uh, this would not be hydro, it would be sol uric acid. See how easy that was? Sulfuric acid. Pretty darn easy. Okay. Well, by the way, if you don't realize it, acids with oxygens in them are called oxyacids. Just for your information. All right, let's look at the next one. HCl. So we're again, we're gonna start right here on our naming chart. And it's the first element a non-metal. Well, hydrogen definitely is a non-metal. It's the first element hydrogen. Put a check mark. Yes, it is. Does the anion contain oxygen? That's this guy right here. And no, it does not. Let's put a check mark right there. Use hydro plus element name with IC. Add acid after name. So this would be hydro chloric acid. Pretty darn snarly, I'd say. Okay. Wow, that was interesting, that noise. Sorry about that. And let's go ahead and let's do the next one. Okay. Okay. Uh, so, let's do this last one here. All right. So what we got is, again, we're going to start here. It's the first element, a non-metal. It is. And that's this one right here, of course. And it's the first element, hydrogen. Yes, it is. You put a check mark there. Does the anion, that's this guy right here, does it contain oxygen? The answer is no, it does not. So use hydro plus element name with IC, add acid after name. So this would be hydro, and this would be fluoric acid. And that's it for this lesson. You guys be snarly, and we'll see you back here at Moosine Chemistry.